Hey man, how's it going? All right, man. Just, All right. You know, how you been? I'm good. I'm good. I can't complain. Um, I heard you got some good news for me. Yes, sir, man. So I just got acceptance for this position that I've been wanting, right. you know, full time. You know, that'll keep me busy. You know. Help me with my goals later on. So right. awesome, awesome man. So, yeah. Again, proud of you. <laughs> you know, I always, it, it, um, I'm always excited. You know, um, and again, as long as you continue to keep going forward, everything else is going to end up coming into play that how you want to, especially like with housing. Um, and again, this is a start to another start later on down the road. So Absolutely. and who knows what may come up out of it, right? Yeah. So. Um, I even remember at one point you were thinking about becoming uh, a truck driver as yeah. well. So this is just, this is a piece of that, you mm -hmm. know? So, uh, yeah, man, again, and the fact that you're making a living wage mm -hmm. that way you can really support yourself and, and things of that nature. Um, again, uh, man, congratulations. Thank you. know, you, Like man. I said, I try not to, try, try to be, <laughs> <laughs> you know, what we've been through, you know, to get, to see this point, I feel you. You, you know, to see this, um, you know, um, to see you come from where you came from to, you doing what you're doing now is a blessing. So, you know, you know, continue Absolutely. moving forward. So I'll see you soon. Thank you. Appreciate it. That's it. So All right. <laughs> like, how did you go about employment, um, housing, and, you know, hooking up with the right people to stay free? Oh, man. You know what? Uh, I'm, I literally applied for probably about 400 jobs mm -hmm. every week. Right, you know, from you know, doing stuff through social media, different um, job fairs and things of that nature. But I think one of the things is my boys, you, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. And also now what as we say this thinking thinking, it, it, it pops up in our mind. You you know, like man, look, this right, is you, you know what I mean, I, I knew what would have ended up happening, but also I knew that this was a start and I I knew this can kinda open up some doors. Well that was the hope things, you know, it can kind of open up some doors to me getting somewhere else. Mm -hmm. um, so you can get home or, or whatever, but, you know, also was still a plot you got now, but at the same time, the the whole thing is, is that what you, yes. Um, again, that's the hustle, right? You know what I mean? You say hustle, that's a, that's, that has been kind of, you kind of bought into this negative thing. But no, it's it's my drive, it's my hustle to be able to keep going forward. This I know I have to start here, one son here, other son here, you know, let me go I gotta drop y'all off. So it wasn't like, okay, hey, automatically this is alright, this is it. I got you you, you know, I like kept going forward. Something better was on. Those are the moments I live for. Those are um Sorry, okay. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> you know, but those are that's that's no there's no other way of me saying that. You know what I mean? Because because the thing is, you started from where you started from, mm -hmm. you're going to somewhere different. You have to be but you're you're in charge of that. You're you have to make the the decision. You know, you're, and how, you know I know churches is actually your thing. And you continue to make a way for us, you see what I'm saying? So that's what I find, you know, within you. That I resonate with, you know what I'm saying? So, I mean. Your full name, I want to make sure that I'm, I'm getting Jordan Ross, right? Yeah, I'm Jordan, J O U R D Y N. I'm so glad you spelled it. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a Ross too. Ross, R O S S. Okay, cool. And, and I like to ask about how old you are, if that's all right. Too. Um, 27. I made 27 last month. Okay. Happy birthday! That's Thank you. Birthday. Yeah, yeah, 27. Wow, yeah. 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 To, to 27. I mean, I was raised in a single parent home. You know, uh, I was the youngest and the only boy. So once my mom was out working and things like that, I really didn't have any role models or mentors around in the neighborhood. I grew up in um, Detroit, areas like that. The role models that we have are not so positive all the time. So I kind of, you know, became a product of my environment and whatnot. And that led me to not doing, you know, such great things and whatnot. But I always felt like, you know, if I had a father or a father figure in my life, you know, I choose a different path. But when I'm just surrounded by so much violence, drug dealing, gang banging, it, you know, it's kind of inevitable to, you know, escape that. So, you know, cause it's, it's, it's life to them, you know, cause they've been here and, you know, they struggle with the same things that I'm struggling. 
So they never like turned their back. If I'm incarcerated, I could call, they answer. You know, if I'm out here doing good or bad, they answer, you know. Um, like he was saying, like, I, I, I call him 2 a.m., you know, like, man, I got a problem. You know what I'm saying? And, like, he'll never ignore the phone call or anything like that. He, you know, since day one, you know, they had my back, you know. I don't really find that, especially, like, you know, in our culture. Like, it's usually like a dog-eat-dog -dog place. But, like, when you got, you know, great role models like that, man, it makes you want to do better, you know. And when I get older and when I, you know, get myself fully together, I'm definitely going to be, you know, the one giving back and, you know, trying. It's just, it's just something that I got to do because, you know, like, ain't nobody else going to help us but us, you know. So that's something that I always wanted to do is, like, get, you know, my felony expunges, expunged and whatnot. And um, just seeing him do it, you know, that let me know that I can do it. Like, everything, like, he... He he's a great speaker and all, but like behind the scenes, like he really, really do what he talk about. And, and if 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 he can do it, I can do it. That's the big thing with me with him. It's like just seeing the things that he do, I know I can do it as well. You know, so I need help, and he always there when it, when I can't get help from other places. Like you know, what I'm saying he always there. You know, whether it be words, but most time it's actions. Right, because he says... Up, you're looking, yeah. And I'm trying to hide my... That's why... And I'm also doing these angles because I've got to get my cast. And so... So you look like super... So you be, be Cooper, superhero, yes. These are always... I like it's what the camera likes mm -hmm. and then I can put a nice blur on it I can slow it down I can make it feel you know much bigger than than surprisingly you know but that's just it cell phones used to be people used to make fun of this that's the cool thing like 125 uh, 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 so I have a drone? Uh, yeah. Um, you want to see the bottom of it? Yeah. Yeah, this just gives me almost like a... You're so good at this. Really great tight shots as you're turning some pages. Lighting in here is so Ow. happen to have. I know we were, I, you probably didn't have time to text anybody this. <sighs> this is official. Oh, wow. 
welcome. This is the official paperwork. Oh, this is just a blessing. Put this up. Get it. Official audit. Chance for a new start, right? It's beyond. Makes your heart happy, I think. Mm -hmm. You know, it's just yeah. joy. That's, that's joy. Yes, yeah, it's just about, yep. Yeah. Oh, 1999. I'm so glad I came to do this with you. This there, there was, there was, that was when Dad got it, you know? Yep. It has to be signed by, yeah, by the governor and then also by the uh, Secretary of State. Wow. Such a good feeling. And it was recently awarded the 2019 um, City of Madison Humanitarian Award um, for his work developing long-term strategies to reduce um, community violence. I find, I find him deserving of extraordinary relief. Uh, now, therefore, Tony Evers, governor of the state of Wisconsin, by the authority vested in me by Article V, Section 6 of Wisconsin State um, Constitution, do fully, unconditionally pardon Anthony B. Cooper, Sr. of the uh, offenses described above and restore to him all the rights and privileges which may have been um, forfeited by him as a result of said offenses. Best news ever. Yeah, definitely. You've got to frame this. Oh, yeah, definitely. Oh. Got to show it to Jordan. Yeah, this actually, I'll see him going. Yeah. I want to follow him. <laughs> I think that he's such a success story. Yeah. With him. I forgot to ask him yesterday what part of Detroit, if he was east side or west side, because I lived in Detroit for a couple of years. Oh, yeah? Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, so, so sorry. And I was just not thinking. That's the problem when you're doing 10 million jobs. You're like, oh wait, I should have found that out, but I forgot. <laughs>